This truck is freaking awesome. Work with me here, people. Heading into work. Um, last night I put my two weeks notice in because I got a job at another salon doing colors and that stuff. And they offer a little more money. So I'll go in the Grey Cup see if they want me to finish out my two weeks there or if they want me to leave immediately since I'm working for um, a competitor. We'll be working for a competitor salon. Hope everyone enjoys their day. Well, this is the first time you're seeing my pretty face on here. Um, Saturdays, I usually spend most of the day editing so I can get everything done. Because we've usually been going out the last few Saturdays, so I thought I'd get all the editing done before we had to leave. So I didn't even think to turn the camera on, but uh, I think Nikki probably said hi to you guys earlier. Uh, yeah, we're just headed to Ankeny. Um, we seem to go there a lot lately. Our friend Kate is having a birthday party. They're having the pre-party at her and her boyfriend's house. And then we're going to head to Styx, the pool hall that we went to for the 100th uh, episode with Tom and Mindy. So we're going to hit that up. We're taking the back route. Just, it may not be necessarily faster. It's just, it just seems faster. So maybe it is, but it just seems that way. Instead of going all through downtown and trying to get on the interstate. I haven't seen Kate in quite a while. I remember the last time we physically saw her. Her and Nikki always were, the, she was always the one that would come up and talk with Nikki whenever we go to parties and stuff in Newton, so Nikki's kind of missed her. It's been, a, really, it's been a while. I don't think, I'm trying to remember the last time we saw her in person since we moved out of Newton. We've seen her since we moved, haven't we? Oh, I don't think so. jacket so even though my shirt we tucked in my jacket can hide this you get to see me in a tuxedo I've never worn one I know you wouldn't even wear one to our wedding cuz I don't like them I don't like all that shit on me we weren't doing a big fancy wedding she just went to Las Vegas again that would have been a lot more expensive than yeah what we well did. yeah well what it was just <laughs> all the money went there and hit her we didn't have enough to spend to go to Vegas. That was the whole point. What we spent on that wedding, which was like a less than a thousand, was like a thousand dollars or less, it would cost us a lot more to go to Vegas. Did you drink in the night? Turn right on to Road R6F Northwest 66th Avenue. You gotta work tomorrow at 10, right? Yep. It's a good thing you looked at your schedule because you told me you were off Sunday and Monday. So it looks like you had some fun yesterday up there in uh, Iowa Falls with Drew. Oh yeah. He's freaking fast, man. Watching you trying to follow him in the hallway. And he's tall too. I try to get to show his height with his classmates. Uh, did you see the turkey? Yeah. Um, don't zoom in that close anymore. Why? Because it gets all pixelated. Oh. Actually, I think you can go up to the 3.0 mark if you watch when you're zooming in. You know how they counted it up. If you stop at three, that's where the digital well, zoom. I didn't know. I didn't know. Yeah, I, I've never zoomed in that far, but so I didn't know either. But now, yeah, I don't. Go, I've never gone past 3.0, so I don't know what. We can do a test with it and see. But yeah, I got it on there. But you can still see what it is. It's not like it's really pixelated 1980s style video. 
He was a big sucker. He would have been a trophy turkey. So but how did you almost hit him if he was way over there in that field? He crossed in front of the van. Oh. And before I get my camera out, he heard it going across the thing. He will, if the pipe would have gone or something, I would have shot his ass. He was a prize. Oh, just outside taking a break. It's, it's weird because we know maybe like five, six people at this party and it's kind of awkward. You, you don't know very many people. So we got me come outside and just get away for a minute. Um, this is Kate's boyfriend's new toy though. I thought I'd show you guys. Check out this truck. This truck is freaking awesome. And look at the bed liner. That wood in there. That thing is just gorgeous. It looks like an old Chevy? Chevy? Like an S10? Probably like an S10? So we're here at Applebee's. We left Kate's. They were going to the bar and we just didn't really have the money. And she's not a big bar person. But we hadn't eaten all day, so we decided to come to Applebee's. It's like 11 o'clock at night. It's kind of cool though, because it kind of turns into like a bar atmosphere. We laid back, they got live music, as you can probably tell on top of me. I don't even know if you guys can hear me. I may have the subtitle on this. But yeah, so we're just hanging out here at Applebee's, getting a bite. And then the plan is to go home and watch a movie, but more than likely, Nikki's gonna fall asleep. I'm gonna fall asleep. But we'll see what happens. So yeah, we're just hanging out, having a meal. Um, I had a few drinks. Just a few. Okay, I finished off a six pack of Angry Orchard. They're good. They're freaking. You're drinking apple cider like with alcohol. You don't realize you're drinking alcohol and you like next thing you know you're six of them are down and you're about ready to fall down the stairs. So, yeah, so get some food on, got a burger and a steak coming with some shrimp, some cajun sauce. It'll be good. So these are these new pretzel like things for our appetizers and all our appetizers are like half off. Freaking awesome. And then you get this cheese sauce down here. It's like Blue Moon beer and cheese. Freaking awesome. It's freaking awesome. For three dollars. It's after like eleven o'clock. Yeah. Freaking pretzels. Awesome. And you get a little honey mustard sauce over here. That's your honey mustard. That's the cheese. This is a pretzel. Mmm, y'all want some? Here, I'll put a little cheese on it for you. There you guys go. Mmm.